there's no secret, obviously, about the infighting that's going on in the White House, but I think the big question is, what are the repercussions of it? And if you look to Capitol Hill, you can see it. It's been laid bare over the last couple of weeks. As one very senior Republican official on Capitol Hill told me, there's no White House, there's White Houses, as in nobody knows who actually speaks for the president. And what that does for members of Congress is creates a lot of difficulties. We saw it just in a meeting last week. Reince Priebus, Vice President Pence, Paul Ryan, uh, and Kevin McCarthy, the GOP leadership, basically the White House told them they had to put the health care bill on the floor. Speaker Ryan said, we can't do that. We don't have the votes. The White House basically threatened them and said, you don't know the realities here. You don't understand the politics. There's just a lot of confusion here. And you wonder where that goes from here. Well, when they get back from their two-week recess, they'll have four days to pass a spending bill. I'm told there are elements in the White House right now who are willing to shut down the government to keep the wall funding in there, something that Republicans in both the Senate and House would like to move to another time. So, Pan. no solutions yet. <laughs> Dick. Okay, four fun days ahead.